Hello Space Engineers, Wellington612 here, and welcome back to Scrapyards here at the base. Which is where I found my clone when I just started the game. Uh, yeah, so, uh, quite a bit to do I think. I have been away from the game a while, let me just go into, oh there it is right there. Uh, the to-do list, because I did do quite a bit off camera, and I can't remember what, but um, I did make notes. To do list. I mean, that's pretty much what we want to sort of do as habitation today, so do some bits and pieces. Uh, off camera, block management, naming, and reworked trees and mod, and continue to develop barge art. That's right, now I remember. Now I remember. Okay, so first of all, uh, over here... Uh, at the end of the last episode, well actually no, not the last episode, it was the last episode for me, but it was the episode before that for you, because um, things were just a little bit out of order. Uh, I put these trees in, I reworked these, so if I go into this camera, uh, I got rid of all the stuff underneath that I had, um, those pink blocks. I mean, those, you're, you're still there. Um, but uh, yeah, I did that. And I pasted these in in creative mode. The other thing I did was, just in regards to block management, was in the entity list, I named a whole lot of stuff as well. Uh, so you can see I've actually named them as trees. Okay, uh, what's that? That's, oh, that's that thing. Storage crate. Oh, yeah. And I named all the storage crates as well. So that's another thing I named. Uh, and I tried to name some of the individual components as well. So, yeah. Because I have done some work on the mod. So, hopefully this has already been published by the time this video comes out. So there's the alien stuff. So, um, yeah. So I've done the little icony things. Um, so you know what's what. There's still some more to add, but they're kind of all they're getting there. Um, yeah, so that's uh, that's that. That will come useful for a later series, I think, and it's certainly coming in useful here. So yeah, that's uh, that's that. Let's jump down to check out some of this stuff. Um, so yeah, like I, I'd already named some of these. I mean, I didn't have to, but you know, just just when you're going through the entity list. Oh, actually, the other thing that I did was I did clean out this as well. So I just jumped down, uh, did an entity list report distance from player, and just deleted all the small grids that were within like 10 meters, and that got rid of all of those. So, so uh, yeah, so that's that's what I thought. Just you know, keep it things tidy. Uh, but yeah, this is what I did some work on. Oh, now <laughs> we're not doing the edit. <laughs> I just sort of signed off and said goodbye, and then I was like, oh, what's missing from here? And I sort of came around, oh, we're missing an engine, so yeah, <laughs> to move move one of the engines. Um, so that was that was blown up in the last episode. Uh, we're actually turned on, that's good. Um, so yeah, we will need to find some more engines, I think, just for the back thrust and potentially the side thrust. But anyway, I did quite a bit with this. So that's right, I put on the second second engine which I haven't actually completed let's do that now uh, have I got stuff in my inventory we'll soon see um, what was it? it was like one of those maybe yeah there there and there and then there was a, a light it's down the right spot here it is light so i've been i was wrapped with how this came out and the fact that it works as well that's a bit of a bonus <laughs> because it, it can lift things and not crash so the first thing i want to do today is build a landing pad for this particular thing let me just grab some parts so yeah i named all these i think i made some more as well did i make another one i made another one because look there's that there i thought i made two but maybe not um, yeah, anyway, so that's cool, where am I going over here? Okay, let's just copy that, and paste that, and so yeah, so there's a ladder on here, we'll put the buttons on, um, so you can climb up, and I've put a 
control thing in, put some handrails as well. And I put this control thing in so that, uh, uh, might just let me, let me do this. Light. Just add that new one to the group. Oh. There we go. So, yeah, you can now fly it. Um, by itself. Which is good. Uh, I also moved the merge block to the back. So, because that was annoying me with the other the other thing. The, the glider. Because it was, yeah, I wanted to pick up stuff with that front landing pad thing. So anyway, uh, you more lights on the front, I think. Yep, so that's that's real good. I'm loving it. I love this um, flying barge. It has come out so well. And uh, yeah, got the option to merge on the glider and make it a really versatile thing. But you could just, you know, take it away by itself. Um, but this was more for just moving it around, storing stuff. And yeah, it, the intention's not that you necessarily fly it with us all the time it is a combo with the um with the the glider so uh yeah so that's come out real good um i'm just wondering whether we need some more like parts in there of some description like another set of another set of these so if i kind of went like yeah, maybe. How does that look? And yeah, I think that will just help. Add a bit of um, imaginary strength. Yeah, definitely in the same family as the glider. Right, let's uh, let's make a landing pad for it. So we'll hop up here again. And what I was gonna do? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Is. Um, build it out here. Now my only thought was, do I put a walkway down, or did I put the concrete pad? I think a walkway. So like this. Oh, actually, just now I think about it, something else I did do was I think I put some stuff in here when I was doing the thumbnail. Yeah, like, just put some more catwalks in and stuff. I don't know what's going to go here, but something could go here. So I did some work there, so that was that was good. Um, So this one, I think we only kind of need to have a gap for one here. Okay, do I have steel? Yeah, I've still got steel. Okay, um, so, as you know, we'll need to put on another one because of those rails. Then if we go like oh, that, and that, oh, oh, oh. Um, what sort of size is, how wide is it, will it fit? Right through there. Okay. So width. Okay, it's gonna be one, two, three, five. Okay, it's quite wide. <laughs> a very a very definite five blocks wide. Um which oh that's that's the same width as this one. Hmm. Because that is five. But I think. Oh, if I put just five in to start with. If I put five in to start with, then we can figure out from there. 
uh, how things go. So, let's just put some lights in. Like this. So that'll go in like that. That'll go like that. And then we need to kind of replicate this stuff. So that's a half block and then, yeah, like that's it. So it's there. So, uh, concrete. So if we replicate that like that okay and then put on those like so one two three okay and then we go across so what I was thinking was that I would, hang on, let me put these things in, I think it's, yeah, it's that one there, like so, and like that, uh, what colour is that? Yeah, so that's what I was thinking, and we'll just make it like twice as long. Have to pick some stuff out of there, I guess. Uh, I'll put in a linking pipe between here. So this is going to be uh, this will be one of these. And then we'll put in some of these, which are those ones with the doodakis on them. Like so, and then it'll link that up nicely. Cool, cool. Okay. Um, yeah, and I think that will, will work. I have to dig some stuff out of here probably, but yeah, that's reasonably wide. Hmm. Okay, let me weld all this up and we'll land the thing and see how it goes. Right, uh, let's go grab the thing we bought, the barge. See if it fits. I might regret putting all those extra things on. Rails and things. Since I haven't tried it. Let's give it a whirl. Whoa, that's not right. Uh, um. Okay, let's do groups, landing, unlock. What went on there? Okay, straight away it's looking not super long enough. You never know. <laughs> uh, that's going to be a new. Hmm. No, I think it's going to need to be one block wider all around. Hmm. Okay. That's a bit of a fail. Never mind. Okay, perky. That is uh, that's good. I'm liking that. Uh, had to sort of take two goes at it because I originally had the diagonals across there, but it didn't quite fit. But now it fits. So yeah, that's um that's real good, real good. Uh, I'm just thinking ahead. I'm not going to do it right now, but the idea is is that our sort of hydrogen type rocket thing I think will be up in this sort of area somewhere. So we'll just continue to work our way up the hill. So I put in this tree here and. I also put in some more up somewhere, up in amongst there, so yeah, it's, it's just, oh, it is coming together. I am super stoked with it. Um, yeah, so anyway, this is, um, 
Yeah, that's good. It's good. Good, 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 good. Uh, plenty of space. Um, but we won't really be able to unload it up here, which is not the idea. What I want to do is make a, um, make a, 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 a sort of a bit more of a formalized landing pad down here. And I do have a bit of an idea. But I need to get a conveyor in first of all, and I think I'm going to take this opportunity, since it's night time and it's raining and it's horrible, uh, to do some changes to this. So I'm going to have to start by probably moving these oxygen things, they're just, they're too big to be in here anyway. Um, and yeah, I'm going to actually move this pipe and put it up here, and then put a pipe across here which can come out here, and I want to put a bit of a veranda out here. I think that'll work quite well. Uh, and it'll also mean rejiggling this a little bit, so I'll make some changes there. But first, we need to move those oxygen things. That's a start up. So I can do that with this. And I'll probably need to move those other things, because it's going to basically mean rebuilding the lower section of this wall as well um, but the first thing will be to get these out gentle oh really oh because I unlocked it instead of locking it okay we'll just drag that along the ground a bit I think over here is going to be a better spot anyway I will, uh, I'll probably turn the camera off for most of this. Ugh. And then after that, uh, once the sun comes up, we should probably go out and get some more materials. Because I think we've got enough, but we also don't have heaps. I think we'll put this over here. Like. Put it in this corner here, I think. Nice and out of the way. We're not going to need the oxygen for a little while. Something like that. Let's go out this door, because we can. Yay. Whoa. This thing doesn't like um, ice too much. <laughs> okay, that, that was a mistake coming out this way. <laughs> Yeah, so um, probably means extending this pad a bit as well, which is uh, is fine, but I'll need some more steel. Uh, so if I just go in here and just leave that there for a sec. And if we look in here, uh, there's some stone in my inventory, I don't know why. Um, so we've got plenty of those, plenty of those, but yeah, so it's starting to get down a little bit, well not down, but you know, we've used a bit of st small steel tubes, so it'd be good to get some more of those. And... Motors is alright. Uh, now, I can actually make motors, and I need to switch it to assembling. <laughs> That's... <laughs> I noticed that in the edit, when I was making some motors last time, that uh, I didn't actually have it. Uh, I still had it, I just assembled some. <laughs> it was only like 10 or 20, it was nothing. Um, but yeah, so that's, uh, that's good that we've got that under control. I mean, we've got the nickel there. Detector components? What? Oh no, we can't break them down anyway. The only thing in amongst this lot that has nickel is motors, but also some of these things as well. So that's pretty much tools is where we're kind of getting, getting it from. And the oxygen bottle and stuff so when we get the bottles yeah that's that's quite good which I wonder is there actually bottles anyway I think there's those in the cockpit but yeah. anyway um right so yeah let me I think do this off camera and I'll show you when it's done because it's just going to be doing blocks boring boring blocks don't need to see it I'll come back when it's done and show you do the old tour And good morning, again, uh, sit rep, actually that should probably be I think, that uh, landing, landing pad. So yeah, I say again because I've recorded a little bit of an intro for this morning, it's tomorrow for me, 
Uh, but I had my microphone muted, so we'll give it another go. <laughs> I did sort of come in as I was building this landing pad. Um, so I have to show you how that works now, because underneath here is a connector. Aha! So yeah, I just I just got a whole load of steel from the warehouse that's over there. There's something spawned over there that we're going to look at in a minute. Uh, if I was to go through here, maybe. Inventory oh, full. Okay. Let's just get rid of some of the steel. Hang on, stand by. Um, yeah, so I'll show you what I did off camera and what I did kind of on camera, but I've now deleted because I didn't have any audio. Okay. So, under here is, um, there's a pipe. Oh, hang on. I just, I don't need, oh, I'm going to get stuck. Oof. Might just leave those in there. Those, those. That was just scaffolding to stand on. Oh, now I'm stuck in the hole. Right. Um, so, yes, there is a piston to get the connector up to the right spot underneath the um, stuff there. And. Oops. And yeah, so. Yeah, I think that probably should be yellow, actually. If I did it in that color. Might look a little bit better, it's just a bit bright. Yep. Might sort of fit in a bit better. Probably need some lights and stuff in there too. I just need to get the tree. There we go. Put stuff in there. No, we'll just have yeah. I'll come I'll come back to that. I'll camera right uh so yeah so there's there's a pipe that's hidden underneath the apron comes here comes out here so this is all the above ground stuff this took a little bit of time um but i'm quite happy with how it's come out so i've put this veranda on that involved moving this section of wall um back so you can see how the door the door's on that side and the wall's on that side so originally the whole all the wall and stuff is on that side which is still the same with these bits here uh, yeah, so that's that's good. I like that. It gives a bit of protection from the rain, which it's been raining all night here on the earth like. Uh, yeah, it's just been a very, very drizzly night. Um, so yeah, lifted the pipe up, so that's out of the way, and I think a bit more visual up there, so that, that works, I feel. And then out here, again, the pipe's just changed a little bit in its format, which now we've got this this way, which I like better. I don't think I've actually climbed up here. I hope it works. And it works. No, it doesn't work. 440. Oh, there's another one. That's that's a new one. That wasn't there a second ago. Uh, yes, we're up. Hey. It's uh, just to say, where's the glider gone? But I'm using it down there. Uh, yeah, and I. She will just fly this down and connect up because we will go over and check out those things, and I want to go over to the like so we are sort of running a little bit short on things i mean that steel would have helped but i'm going to use that um yeah well we're not too bad on those but your motors are sort of getting down the steel tubes small steel tubes it's just starting to get down but the, the steel yeah because i'll probably use most of that um right let's turn this off recharge yeah so i can't remember if i said or not but um there is a I have made a collection now for these builds I've um, hopefully there'll be more I like that I like that H in the yellow bit was um yeah hopefully it will uh, uh, be a bit more updated than what it is at the time of recording but um, yeah that, that is there it'll it's linked in the um, in the description of the description below which I'll also put the mod in for the trees as well. I'll link that in today's one and probably the one, the last couple as well. So while it's relevant, uh, yeah, so that's, maybe I should lock that to the ground actually. Can I do it? Yes, I can. So I'll lock it. And then we'll merge this on. 
yeah because i did do some and this when i published this one and i think it's actually ready to publish so i might do that sooner rather than later i'll publish it with this attached as well because this has got some changes made to it mainly the uh, where the um, merge block is so that will be fine that uh, I probably need to put those landing gears back on do that do it like that hey hey very good uh, yeah that's all we really need okay that's where we go Four point something case. Oh, this is a beast. Um, what I should do that one increase. going over here somewhere and we'll check it out oh there it is there that didn't take long uh, is it on this side of the hill no. oh it's just that it's right there it's right there okay they're just gonna be 4k so the other one's over over that way sort of which is on the way to the lake hangar. Okay, what have we got? We've got it's like a little farm thing. Cool, okay. Well, I'll uh, just quickly salvage this. The one thing that we are missing on this is somewhere to put small grid things. Oh, down. oh and now there's something over there! Oh, gosh, stuff spawning everywhere. But I think we should make our way over to that hangar and then we'll get our way back, probably. Uh, I don't think there's anything that I really need. So I think it's just going to be salvaging. Salvaging the stuff. Yeah, so we'll head over there next to that one. Ugh, looks like another farm. So today's going to be a farm day, is it? Load that there. That's it's a combine harvester or something, I think. Ooh, I might keep that on the way back. Yeah, we might take that with us actually. Um, actually hang on, I'll just let up. Combine harvester. Pretty sure that's what it is. We'll get that covered there in a second. Yeah, okay, so that, I think, can go into the recycle pit. That would be a good one to go in there. There's nothing. Battery, yeah, that's alright, we've got batteries. What's in there? I'd say... Sorta. What are you? Medium cargo. Uh, no, we've probably got enough of that. Just make sure there's nothing... 
no light um, thrusters or anything. Not seeing any. So now that can that can go back as is. Put that up on the way through. And stop. Okay, and we are there. Right, me there. Okay. So this has got one of those. So hmm, could probably take that back with us. There might be some oh. and we do need more steel so yeah I think we'll take that back we will definitely take this back um, that's actually something I kind of want to do today as well it's pretty much put like a shed in um, a electrical storage shed. Yeah, I'll just stick that on top because that'll be a good source of lots of steel. Um, and kind of all on the roof. Or, no, we could probably fly. Okay, I don't think I'll be able to pick this up. No, it's got a battery and all sorts of stuff in it. So, yeah, let's just create a bit of room. these bits so I don't crash into them. That should be fine. As well since I'm here just take some of these off. Cool. No loot. Right there. Jump up there. Oh, this is such a good setup. And why are you not welded up. How interesting. Nice small steel tube. Err. Find one of those somewhere. Uh unlock. Toggle on on off. Okay. I moved the, um, I just moved those things over on the toolbar as well, just so that they're in the same spot as before. Okay, so this should be able to sneak in under here. Lights are not good. No, lights are on. Hmm. Now I can pick up the, pick it up with my nose. Now I've got that. Move that merge block to the back. Good. Should I tell you what? There's probably no reason why. I don't grab that at the same time. There seems to be a reason. Oh, oh. Oh. It's locked to me rather than me locking to it. Inventory full. Okay, so that'll just give us a bit more uh, steel for whatever we need. Oh, I just need to grab something which I saw here. Yeah, I don't know how I missed that, hmm, but I did. Uh, right, so we just need to lock that down, so that's all sorted. Onwards we go. Um, we'll pick up that harvester. Something else might spawn, oh, I know where I need to go. I also need to go into the canyon, because there's something down there. 
this way. It was out the back. Yeah. Ah, uh, because old future Wellington saw it when he drove back from, from the base, so that's still sitting there, I think. So we're going to have a scope out there. But oh, that's good to get that stuff. Um, yeah, it's real good. Hmm, not the thing I was looking for. Um, let's just make a quick cool. Let's just make a quick GPS here. I'll grab that on the way through because yeah, there's something down in here. I missed it when I came through, but it's just yeah, somewhere down in here. I think it might have been up over in there. Because I, or Future Wellington, came around this way, back up. But there is something, oh look, there it is. Oh, how did I miss that? I literally drove right past there, or well, Future Wellington did. Hmm. Now, oh, well, let's leave the man in the blue suit alone. He did a good job. Yeah, I must have just been focused on getting around the corner. Um... Okay, that's just looking like a... Uh, oh, it's really not anything of significance. It's just a turbine or something, I think. I think we'll skip that. Go back, we'll grab that helicopter, we'll grab the combine harvester, and uh, yeah, we'll take those back. And yeah, just wondering with the helicopter, whether I try and fix it. I'm keen on fixing some of these these things like I did with the, the, the thing in your Bob, uh, the Winnebago, or camper van, or whatever it is. So we'll just, we'll just pick this up, I think, with the, the landing gear that's on this. So we won't muck about. We'll just go over and For the tree. Yeah, because this one's quite intact. Relatively speaking. Yeah, no, I think it might be quite cool to, to fix fix one of those little ones. Oh, but this this barge is working super well. I mean, there's I'm just picking these up from underneath, but there's nothing to stop me loading them up on top either, you know. So my only limitation with this build is the um, having a drawer to stick some small grid stuff in. I'll just press that while I grab it. There we go, got it. Right, take this back and we'll throw it in the grinder pit. I'll, um, I'll go get the one that's down over there a little bit later. Pick up a bit. Ugh. There we'll do. Ah. Okay, uh, we might just pop this through here. Try not to take out the trees. Uh, oh, it should, it should go this way because that's the way the other barge goes. Here. Yeah, that's good. Uh, I can't take a running jump off the end anymore. Right. 
Let's cruise you. <laughs> oh, that never gets dull. That never gets dull. That's awesome. Nom 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 nom. Gobble 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 gobble. Yeah, that's a pretty good way to get steel as well. I mean, I did grind some dude. Well, off they go. Uh, see the shadow coming back. Oh, in the hole. Nearly. No, not quite. It's bouncing around. Woo! Don't know where that went. Hmm, okay. Uh, right. Oop. Stuff flying out everywhere. Right, I don't know where the other bits and pieces went, but... They went somewhere. Okay, let's turn that off. That was a bit of fun. Uh, right. So... And uh, this um, battery. So I think we need to make a bit of a home for the batteries. And probably up here is where that home would be. So I was kind of thinking sort of around here. Warfare battery? Yeah, it is. So a little warfare battery there. And I think, I think there's one over here as well, isn't there? Yeah, there's one there, Warfare. So I think the three Warfare batteries will pop into here. So I've got steel on board, yes I do. So... I sort of think... That... Could like just link on to the first wind turbine maybe just be in the vicinity of it at least okay so if I kind of did a hmm maybe I'll stick with that format It'll be like that. It'll be like that. So that'll be th three. I think I could like dig it into the bank, but I don't think it would go in this. Maybe, 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 maybe it's thinking that it's the wrong one. Ah, oh, see, there you go. Ah, uh, right, that was a bit of a bug. Uh, okay, so uh, let's grab this one. Well, why did you? You were balanced there for so long. Why did you decide? Just right then, you were going to do that. Ugh. Um. Oh, well. 
Aquí es. Aquí es. And please put the well pad on the bottom. And I guess we should grind down that one as well. I thought I was making life easier by doing that, but obviously not. Okay, uh, if we just put that back up like that. Drop. Yes. No worries. Hey. Okay. Right, let's just dunk out here for a second. Well don't know why I keep doing that. Oh, and these things can be deleted and deleted. Okay, so you we can access, you we can't. So I need to take ownership of this one. Stuff. Oops. Okay, I didn't stop quick enough. Never mind. I think we've got a few power cells. Oh, 98 of them. That's fine. We're not going to use them anywhere else. Okay, so I own that now. That's good. Uh, we should probably name these. So this is going to be battery, uh, lake, side, base. Number one. Ooh. It's got lake side roll. Okay. Let's get it up there and somewhere. Uh, um yeah, that's fine. Okay, that's so the other one is inside. Well, Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be great with that, so we'll move it out. So I think the other thing I'm going to do today is um, start to put together the hydrogen tanks. I have a little bit of a plan. Whoops. Yeah, so we're sort of all over the show today, just tying up little bits of bits and pieces, little loose ends here and there, working towards, you know, sort of the, the base. Um, I should probably go out for another scout around as well, while it's daylight. Oh, but I'll finish off this thing first. I think, oh yeah, I must own this because it's green. Okay. Right over here again. Good, okay, might just land this on here because we'll take the barge out. Because there is still something over there that needs to be picked up, I think. Let's just pop that down there. Down there. Okay, just like that. System works. Right. Uh, we'll just put some more bits of metal and stuff on here and just change the name of that battery. So that will be 
that. So I think three will be absolutely more than sufficient. In fact, it's probably too many if I'm honest. But here we are. That's that. Uh, we'll put some more stuff in here. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. And go like that across the front. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, I'll just finish this off. I'll be back in a sec. So then, it has, uh, it's been a while. I've done a bit of stuff, uh, and yeah, sit rep before we go for a bit of a think a flight before the sun goes down completely. So yeah, I just put some stuff in there. So this this is sort of from here onwards is the what I've done. Uh, I've got a little bit of a tree in here, and yeah, so I did a little bit of landscaping and things. Come up the stairs. So yeah, this it's, it's all really starting to come together quite well. Uh, yeah, not heaps of trees, but just enough to create a bit of interest. And yeah, here we are. So, first of all, automatic LCDs. This is why it took a while, because I set that up. So that's all going. I loaded all these things in, so now we can see the batteries on the stomper and the and the base and, and that sort of carry on. Uh, they are just, I think, emptying, because I am recharging the um, glider. Glider, yep. Uh, yeah, and there's the wind turbines, so uh, if we have a look over there, you can see number one, number two, number three, number four, number five. So I numbered them, sorted them out, and yeah, that's uh, they're all optimal, so that's uh, that's good. Good, good, good. Uh, the, I have I have been asked questions about whether they're too close together uh, in the comments, and uh, but no, as you can see, they're all, all optimal, so that's fine. Then. So yeah, we've got our batteries in here, so and also the hydrogen engine on the thing in there as well so that's good to have that set up uh i am just contemplating whether i need another shed over uh over this way i should say shack is makes sense um but it sort of depends what goes in here uh yeah uh no uh would i mean if if i had o2 generators they would probably go here quite well but yeah, it would just be good to kind of, I don't know, have a think about that. Anywho, so I'm really quite happy with how that came out. And yeah, I think it's time to move on. I am also just thinking that I do need some stairs, I think like down through here or something. I think that might be quite good. Just kind of follow that pipe. I mean, I could go down and under and that way. That, that could be quite cool. Yeah. Anyway, we'll let future ones worry about that. Okay, we'll just go down this way for now. Right, so yeah, let's jump into the uh, glider and see what we can find. Uh, now, to load these up as well with the recharging thingies. There we go, so now we are free. And unlock, and we should be away. Yes, we are. Woo! Okay, off we go. Still got stuff in my inventory. Whoops, never mind. So I think we go. I mean, I think there's something down in in this galley down here from memory. I'm sure there was something that triggered over in that direction. So we'll we'll have a bit of a scope out because the sun is just about going down. So yeah, we do need some more like thrusters. I mean, more thrusters for this. And uh, yeah. Uh, looks like another sort of just massive stuff. Um, hmm, nothing too exciting. Uh, although, hmm, I am just looking at that as to whether that could actually go by my hydrogen tanks. I wonder. I wonder. I mean, that would look pretty cool. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, 
Um, I might do it. Let's let's do it. I think that'll look quite cool. I mean, it's got the it's got the gas thing up the top. Uh, yeah. Okay. So right. Let's 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 do some shenanigans, shall we? Uh, how about we do some digging? Get this thing out of the ground. Like so. yeah, that's fine. So what I'll do is she will we'll grab some stuff from over here. It's getting a little bit dark to be going chasing stuff at the moment. But yeah, I think I think this could be quite cool actually. Something is making noises. What's making noises? Oh, is this no? Yes, maybe. Not sure. No, don't know. It's a mystery. those awesome okay so yeah I'll uh, so if I was to go like this Okay, so like that. Where we go? Okay, so that's good. So we have to dig all this out. So, okay, so that's fine. Just all this just to make sure it doesn't clip on anything. Do that, and I will do this. So, so I'll make that up, and I'll put a um, um, connector on top. And that way, yeah, hopefully we can convert this to a to a station uh, to a ship. This is the plan. Uh, construction points, few motors. Okay, we can grab that from over here. So I will do that, and yeah, I'll put a connect a connector up there, because then I can actually just connect to it and control the landing gear and stuff. I think that's probably the best method. Up there. Yep. And here is something going to be back there, which is nothing concerning. Okay. Anyway, uh, yeah. Okay, so I will do that, and then we'll take it back, because then I can land it when we get back to base. That will work. Uh, and yeah, we can just yeah. Okay, there, there, there's there's a plan. That's a plan. That's a real good plan, I think. Okay, yeah, so I think I've salvaged everything that I want to. Let's jump into this, and let's 
just piff all that stuff back in there. Bring the ammo. Uh, we'll grab a... Grab a... that conveyor that's on, uh, yeah, conveyor that's on there, with the, connector, which, I think this might actually work quite well, this, this is a pretty good platform to be working on actually, it's a very good platform, it's in the wrong place, but, uh, let's sort that out, It's an excellent platform. Right. Do. Uh, now let's just bring it up a little. So I can get access to it. Almost. No. Let's not step off of there. It does make me nervous being up this high. I know it's only a game, but. <laughs> uh, off. And connect uh Okay, uh we we're already a ship. We are already a ship. That's awesome. Okay. So let's go and dock with this. I'm confident we'll be able to pick it up. We need to lock. Locked. And we've got another a lot. We we'll use that one. So, arch down. Arch down. We'll do that one. Landing gear. Switch lock. So now we should be able to lift it. Yes, we can. Awesome. Oh, this is going to look real cool. It's going to look real good. Oh, let's just try and level off. It's pushing the wrong button. Oh, look, we're getting above the sandstorm, which is good. Ooh. Okay, there we go. That's what we want. Let's just speed that up. Oh, no, we're back in the sandstorm. Let's get over the top of it. Uh, very good. Okay. Um, so the other thing just to consider is... Um, just whether we could actually get the stomper back down to it. I mean, that's looking pretty lightly, but yeah, I don't think really scouting with a singing Lois is the way to go. Let's get this back to base. I was just thinking, you know, like, I mean, that was, I've got a couple of things there, but really, I think the stomper's the way to go, actually. I mean, this is awesome, the barge, do not get me wrong. Um, but the, well, no, I could go for a flop. I'm just thinking about, we need more stuff. We need thrusters for the front of here, and just some key things like that. You know, another assembler would be probably good. Um, yeah, because we used a bit of stuff just lately, so it would be good to sort of get, get our things back. Um, but that said, I mean, I am sort of getting rid of the stuff that's around here, so we do have fresh spawns available to us. Hmm. Anyway, let's... Let's let Future Wellington worry about that. Um, we'll just get this back. And I think that'll be us for today once we get this in place. Because, yeah, it's been a couple of quite decent sessions for me. Oh, something back there. I can't remember that. I mean, ideally, if we could get down there, but nah, see, it's a drop off at the end. That's a bit of a shame. Uh, real shame. Um, yeah, whether we can get over there. Anywho, we'll try and remember that that is got something over there. I may even fly back over there when it's um, daylight. Because mm. I think once I get back and get this in place, probably it'll just be putting some 
walkways and things like that and because we need to work on the habitation and we are working our way up the hill um, I'm reluctant to sort of put the spaceship together until I've done the habitation otherwise I might be tempted to take off into space and never get the habitation done you know so I do want to do that but I'm I'm happy with how things are progressing um, just let's be clear I'm playing this the way I want to play it I'm playing it um, to share as a video but really I'm playing it for my own benefit as such yeah I'm letting my my enjoyment my play style determine the direction that the thing goes not necessarily um, the video yeah right so let's uh, begin the braking procedure I guess because out, but I doubt we've got much back thrust to actually slow down. So let's go down this way. And we should be able to just maintain our speed by going down. And then I can pull up at the end and our main thrusters can slow us down. That's the plan. Famous last words. But oh, it's, I've enjoyed the the changes, the, the building that I've done with the voxel hands and, you know, making the place look really good with the new trees and sort of things. It's been real good. Okay, I'm just going to have to throw it down. Okay, so I think we try and put this on our big landing pad. We need to just tilt the nose up and with these big thrusters and so many of them, I mean what there's eight. <laughs> Stop in a bit of a Okay. So there's not gonna be room up there right now, so what we'll do is we will drop this down. Gentle, gentle. There we go. And we'll lock. Lock that and unlock that. Now we are free. Yeah, a little bit disappointing I didn't get much stuff. I mean I got things in the inventory, but because there was you know, that was two decent industrial things. Um but yeah, not heaps. Okay, we're down. Okay, so uh what have we got? Oh, little bit of an angle. We've got round thing like that, like that. Okay, so let's go scope this out. See, I feel like I need to put a walkway in kind of up here somewhere. Just, to, just for looks more than anything. So up on here, so if I was to grab this. Let me steal. Again. If I was to grab this, we could put that there. Because where's the ladder? The ladder's on that side. Okay, so the ladder's the opposite corner. So if the ladder's over there, let's let's put it in just so we know. If the ladder is there, then that means the uh, the, 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 the the round thing find it. The round thing is going to go in there. Hmm. Um. I mean, I think that's where I want it, but maybe I need to raise this platform. Maybe that's the solution. Uh. Yeah, so that would mean taking these out. Like so. And 
Ravens. Was that the settlement, or was it a different settlement? Hmm. Uh, so they would come all the way around here. Like that. And I'd need to rejiggle these things. Okay. Uh, yeah. Right. Okay, I think that will do the trick. Um, if we put, hang on. Uh, if we, if we put that like that, that on there. Really, really. Okay, I will grab some parts for a second one. There is indeed a thing three and a half k's over there that's just taunt, taunting me. Um, yeah, that's good. Let's go down here. And we will... I don't know why I just went out. Jump up. Oh, hang on. Uh, we'll put that onto there. Should work. Yeah, see, look, 3.4 k's. We will check that one out before we finish today. Uh, right, so. Unlock. I get the impression we're already unlocked. Anyway. Back. We have to think about color scheme as well. There we go. Uh, ready. And. There. That one there, so take off those rocks. Okay, that's fine. Here. Oh, this is gonna be real cool. I should probably make it the same blue as the um as those other tanks. As the hydrogen tanks. Just down and line this up. Okay, that's pretty much level. What have I just hit? Oh no, I've hit the The you know what. It's just out of here. How is it not there? What's holding that up? Easy problem. <laughs> We're on a bit of a lean. Need to lift. Oh, did that just lock? It did lock. I thought you were turned off auto lock. It is off. Ah. Um. be like that is it okay timer one second 
landing. It's that bug. I don't really want to restart. I just want to get on with it. Okay. Uh, landing. Start. Unlock. Yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Awesome. Okay, let's just go here and this. Okay. Inventory full. Hmm. Whoops. Let's just have that. There. Uh, we can stop that timer again now. Timer. Stop. Okay. Right. Uh, what are they called? Exhaust. Like that. And let's make this one a color. And the same with those underneath. Come back to that other stuff later. Very good. So yeah, we need to sort of um, do the old color thing. finish these off because I want them to be in a sort of finished state. Cool. So that's like that. Get that from down the bottom. Uh, this one. Okay, so we want it to be, I think, that blue that's down there. Brr. Can I jump off? No. Okay, but this up here wants to be this Whoa! Okay, that's unfortunate. <laughs> but not completely unexpected. Okay, that. Sort that out. Um, you could probably come off of there and instead put on. Uh, instead put on. I could even like one of these. Cool. Stupid stuff. Okay, hopefully I can get back in by going up there. Uh, let's just get rid of some of this. Okay, and we'll grab a ladder, and yeah, we did sort of need some steel, and that's kind of it. Um, exhaust. We want fire and smoke. <laughs> Oh, and we need to get the colour. We need to get the colour of this. Okay. Which would be that colour. 
Aber weh. I think that will work quite well. Yes. Okay. Let's put this ladder in. Hopefully we can climb back up. Oops. Up we go. So hopefully we can jump onto there. Onto the barge. Hope we should be able to. First of all, you want to be that colour, and then you want to be that colour, and then colour, and then colour, and so to you. Okay, whoops, wish me luck. Yeah! Worries. Okay, now we've got the blue. Let's sort that out. Job done. We'll sort that one out as well. Okay. Right. Job done. Oh, that looks good. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, I might, I might replace that one with a one of those blocks might make more sense uh yeah we need some lights and stuff as well but um oh but that's no that's real cool I th let's have a look at it from over here and yeah i'm liking that i mean i almost need another one over here unless i have one of those long bullet things the the yeah that could work that could work but, oh, yeah, I'm loving that. That's awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, well, there's only one thing left to do. And that's go over 3.4Ks that way. And see what is in that um, settlement. And then I'm going to call it a day. Call it a night. It's been a, so it's been a big old session for me, this one. Uh, sessions. Two of them. Okay, so go over here. Just a piece of oh, there it is. There it is. Uh, what have we got? A few things. What is it? Oh, it's just another one of these things. This is like few of these today. I mean, it's not really what I want, but... Well, in saying that, is there one... Oh, look, there's another... There's another one right there! <laughs> oh. Oh, now I'm wondering if I put another one in. <laughs> oh, funny. Um... More stuff. Okay. There's a bit of variety here. Um, oh, look, there's another one over there, too. Oh. And that's, that's the tank there that I was thinking about. I think probably one of them would look better. Hang on, let's just go back to this view. See one of those play down tanks across there. I mean, and then do we put another one of these over here? I mean, there's no reason why not. Because that looks... I love that. That looks so cool. And, you know, we haven't got the big hydrogen tank. So I think that just really works. Oh. I think I know what I'm doing. I think I know what I'm doing. Uh, yep. Yeah. 
I think that'll be something for future Wellington to deal with. And um, this has come up so well. It's really coming up awesome. So, yeah, clearly there's some things I've got to do over the next few days off camera with sorting this stuff out. Um, but that's where I think I'll leave this episode. It's been quite productive, I feel. Maybe not so much for the video format, but uh, I've got quite a bit of stuff done and really um, made, I think, some good headway in regards to spreading up this hill. Uh, yeah, I think... Yeah, I think the bullet, which is this one, across, across here, and then another one of these, kind of... I mean, it would kind of be up in here somewhere, I guess. And then it just looks so cool from down here. Yeah, I mean, it probably wants to be up on there, just towering over the place. Awesome, and then there'll be that'll be like a decent beacon from the distance. You know, you can see even at night time, it's like, oh, there's the flame. There's the flame. That's where we need to go. Yeah, that'll be real cool. And that will just fill up this area quite nicely. Very good. Um, that's where I'm going to leave it. There are those ones there as well, but I'm not as fast with... Well, I am so close to the base. We could do whatever we want, really. Hmm. Anywho, as I say, we'll let future ones worry about that. Uh, there's nothing else of interest here. No, it's all just... That is annoying that I carried that one like 20 k's and then this one just spawned right here but anyway. Anywho, so that's where I shall leave it. Thank you everybody for joining me today. I hope you did enjoy today's episode and can join me again next time and until next time. As always, stay safe out there everybody and have a good one.